Welcome to the Segundo. Segundos are secondhand stores in Mexico and they are so much fun, but how do you know if you're getting a good deal? There's usually not prices on things. It's kind of confusing, especially as an outsider. So I am bringing in an expert today, someone who shops the Segundos and knows all the tips. So she's going to share the tips with you. My name is Deals and Deals. We're also going to have a little contest and you are the judge of the contest. So each one of us is going to find something that we think is the perfect thing to win the contest. There's no rules for this contest, but in the end, we will present those things to you, the viewer, and you will decide which of us won. And I'm not sure what we'll win, maybe some beer or something like that, but we'll win something. Let's start today with setting our intentions and introducing you to the folks who I am shopping with today. Hi guys, I'm Tanya. I'm actually here looking for a few things, a coffee table, number one, maybe some lime green accents for my house. Primarily I'm looking for, for purses and bags because there's a, a women's day coming up and they are collecting purses filled with personal items for the women who are not as fortunate as we are that can go out and buy our own things. Tanya is that expert that I was talking about, but let's meet Eva. And I am Tanya's friend down here visiting from the States and I have gotten into Segunda shopping in a big way. So I'm just gonna follow behind her and find what she can't find. So now my intention, I need a new pair of shoes for playing pickleball. I'm not sure if Segundas are a good place for that. Uh, I need things to hold my doors open because as the wind comes through, we've got all these doors in our house and they all slam shut and things to keep the doors from hitting the wall and just kind of whatever is fun and exciting. Normally I shop on Wednesdays. It seems like a lot of the Segundos get their new items that come in on Tuesday because they're almost all closed on that day. Um, I almost start here. This is my friend King's place and he's fair with prices. He has wonderful things. He'll come out and fix your appliances if needed. And so I like to start here. Hello. I'm so glad to see you. So <laughs> glad to see you. I was worried you weren't gonna be here, my friend. I went to drop off my truck at the uh, shop. Ah, so you're gonna give me a good deal today? Yes. Of course. <laughs> so sometimes I look at stuff that's just heavy, but cool looking to see if maybe that's a thing that'll hold my doors shut. I don't know what that is. So I used to have uh, an ice cream cone maker. Uh, like industrial. It was very cool, but I left it behind in Atlanta. Ooh, dog toys. Those are some good dog toys there. That is a... Uh... I think it must be to a fountain, maybe? I'm not uh. sure what it is. Almost reminded me of a gooey duck. A gooey duck? Oh, from Seattle. Gooey ducks. Oh, I... Well, yeah, it is definitely... It's kind of got that, that shape. That is going to be... A heavy thing so we're gonna put that on the the perhaps list that's we've only been here for like 30 seconds so i can't <laughs> can't fulfill my wish right away oh i gotta love this and then there's this who knows the shake weight kind of tv stand versus a coffee table but the colors were kind of right for for what i was looking for we could certainly Paint that. Yes, you can. We can stain it. Yes, yes. If you want to shop the Segundas, you'll need to do it in person, but the sponsor of this week's video, BetterHelp, makes access to licensed therapists convenient and accessible by video chat, messaging, or telephone. If you follow this channel for long, you know that I'm a big fan of therapy, and especially BetterHelp, which is available in Mexico or just about anywhere else in the world. If you want to give it a try, you'll get 10% off your first month if you use my link, betterhelp.com front slash almost retired. Just this past week, I've had three people here in La Paz come out and tell me that they too have used or are using BetterHelp. It's really important to have someone in your life to listen to you and give you helpful, unbiased advice. The platform is really easy to use from getting matched with a therapist to scheduling and having a session, and even for switching therapists if the first one isn't a perfect match. If you think you might benefit from therapy, try BetterHelp. Click the link in the description or visit betterhelp.com front slash almost retired. Clicking that link helps support this channel and it also gets you 10% off your first month of BetterHelp. Now let's get back to our visit with King, including a tour of his home, which he's furnished from the Segundas. Wow, isn't this beautiful? 
Wow, just one nightstand? Just one nightstand. And you just stained this? Oh, it's stunning, King. Oh, the mirror. Oh, wow. So, so what does something like this typically go for? Around 25 with mattress. With the mattress, okay. So how much was it? 25. 25. 100 pesos. 2,500 pesos. So that's $1,250, muscle manos. Yeah. Right. And that's for the bed with a mattress. With and a mattress. Night, uh, well, only one nightstand and a dresser. And, and the mirror. mirror. Oh, wow. So for all of that, with a mattress, right. $1,250-ish, depending on the exchange rate. Yeah, because I'm just comparing it also to Tienda 17. Oh. where this would be much more expensive at Tienda 17 over in Cabo. Absolutely. Absolutely. You know, the one thing that I really like here is that if there's anything that is maybe broken or missing a couple screws and it's loose, he takes care of all of that. So that makes me feel really good about this. For me, he speaks great English. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's helpful as well. Because they don't always, it seems like in most segundos, they don't speak English because this is not Correct. necessarily something that is a big gringo thing mm -hmm. right it, this is more of shopping for locals there's a few. right there's a few yeah there are a few speak english mm -hmm. right and then his wife has a shop too hmm. you guys want to stop by we'll go yeah is it here in in yeah. mm -hmm. or okay we'll make sure it's we'll the go very there. last one yeah, right yeah. very last one on the right okay she has more clothes yeah so just uh thinking about this deal so twelve hundred dollars i paid a hundred and fifty dollars for a very basic headboard to be custom made and that was for one queen size headboard this looks like a king is this a king, is a king. Um, and way bigger plus all the additional stuff so yeah really good deal Fantastic. so this is the beauty of going with someone who's uh, connected get the home tour and everything wow most yeah. of the stuff came out of Second hand store. Most of it. Uh huh. Isn't this beautiful? Wow. So. Buenos dias. <laughs> second hand, second hand, second hand, second hand. <laughs> this gave me my store. That gave me the store. Wow. Okay. This gave me the store. This gave me the store. When you say came in the store, you mean it was brought out here? The, out of the segunda. See. So how do you get this? How do you get this stuff like for the Segunda? We get uh, people. I got some friends that are live in Ensenada and they go across the border and buy everything from me. Ah, OK. So like at garage sales and we go to Woodville uh -huh. and auctions like uh, South Coast auction. Uh huh. And bring it down. Different, okay. different places. I bought this across the street at the Segunda. <laughs> <laughs> but, I, bought, I bought that of my cousin. Uh huh. That was my wife' uh, present for her. Beautiful. Wow. So, How about this uh, this couch here? I have a, a complete set. Mm -hmm. But then I think something wrong with it because every time I sit on it, I go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember how much, like if you bought these, you said you bought it as a good deal. I paid uh, $300. Uh, for sorry. Three hundred dollars? 300 US. 300 US for, yeah. for three of them. Yes. I saw them and like, hey, they match my uh, they guy and Yep. They're not identical, but. But they, yeah, they're very similar. There you go. Beautiful. Cool. Yeah. I love yeah, there's so much you can get. So the reason I have Tanya here is that I have another video with Tanya and Jack, her husband, who is not here shopping today. He got out of that. I was at their house doing a tour, and you can find that in one of these corners. And she was saying how much of this stuff came from the Segundos. I was like, wow, that is beautiful. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. She's like, Segundo, Segundo, Segundo. That's why we're here. This one right here, it came out right here in my Segunda. Oh, wow. That is gorgeous. Isn't that gorgeous? <laughs> See, you get all the good stuff. How many inches? 75. 75 inches. So I 70... got one stock. Right okay, in the there's another one out there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, how much? Uh, what, like 10,000 pesos. So $500. $500 huh? for really big, really big TV. Yes. Uh, so don't tell my wife that I passed up this deal. <laughs>
<laughs> so what about these, like the, the architectural stuff? Like My brother-in-law came from the States and he did them for me. Okay. And the door frame too. Yeah. Well, the door, that door came into the store and we had to restore. Okay. Just for the door itself, uh, to get it restored, it cost me around $1,000. Uh-huh. Just for that door. That is fantastic. What a perfect place for it. Do something like, you know, something that's square, but having a brightly colored one is something that I really would like to have. Got to keep it that Mexican flair that I love so much. Nice. This is a beautiful... Oh my God! <laughs> Stop filming and all. For the the one that's sixty five. Uh, around eight thousand pesos. Eight thousand pesos. Okay. Four hundred dollars for a sixty five yeah. inch TV. Yeah. Slightly more because the uh, exchange rate. Right. Is not as good. Right. So what about this light up here? This oh, it's a little broken on the edge. It's really cool. You mean the basket or the, the... basket light? Yeah. Yeah. It wasn't a light. We turned it into a light. Ah, uh, okay. Oh. It's pretty cool though. Is it for sale? Yes. Quanto cuesta? Uh, 1,000 pesos. 1,000 pesos, $50. Did you see the lime green fan? Quanto cuesta for a, an electric bike with humongous tires? I wanted 20,000 pesos, but we can work with it. Okay, so we're- A bottle of my brother. Okay. <laughs> So a thousand, uh, thousand U.S. dollars, but we can work on that. King, right? And this could be the surprise visit of the day. It wasn't what I was looking for, but my casita has sort of a a sea under the sea kind of yeah, thing. This would going. be some great decor. Cuanto por favor? One hundred. Hundred pesos. A little bit better. Word something. I know you can. I you think I'm going to take this. I may be the winner, guys. I may be the winner on this beautiful glass. That is very nice. Yes. And uh, 100 is $5, Five but we're going to work on that. Yes. We're going to add some well, stuff to it. We're going to add a... Yes. Perfect. Always get yes. <laughs> okay, what about this over here? I don't know what it is. Oh, the doorstop? This thing. I don't need enough. <laughs> is that a part of a fountain or is it? But what is it? I, I don't know. That's the. Okay. Quanto cuesta? 100 pesos. 100 pesos. $5. <laughs>are big carpets too. That they are, my goodness. Oh wow. Holy moly. Okay, so that's, so how much for an incredibly large carpet? Uh, 3,000 pesos. 3,000 pesos, $150 for a really, really big carpet. Okay. okay. Got it. King, even I, before she goes back to Seattle, are gonna do a, a mosaic project. Mm -hmm. So I'm thinking this would be a great plate to break up. So it would have to be cheap if I'm going to break it. Good price. How about, how about, how about 100 pesos for both? <laughs> how much did you want for the plate? I want 80 with the plate. 80 pesos for both with the plate? Oh, this is why it's always my first stop. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Perfecto. Oh, massage chair. How come you don't have that in your house? He doesn't have time. Nice. Does it does it work? Oh my goodness. That's fantastic. That looks like it's in great shape. <laughs> so 80 pesos. Thank you so much. You are US always dollars. Okay. There you go. You got change? 120 for stick. <laughs> <laughs> He's always got it.
But one of the things that I think of when shopping in Mexico anytime in the morning is to come with a lot of small bills. Because you go to an ATM machine and yes, it yes. spits out like just 500, 500, 500, 500. No one can break a 500. Um, right. It's just, especially in the morning, maybe later on in the day. I'm gonna make a video about where you can break your 500s, but make sure you have those small bills for when you're going to the Segundos because you, you probably never wanna pay with more money. than twice the price or, or so. The, the closer you can get to exact change, the better. So unloading the first batch in the car. Okay, we have two, two winners. Uh, yes. Tanya and Eva both have won with an item and I am still looking. That's okay. My family does a, um, a boat race outside of Washington where we make little boats and we race them down this river. All right. Oh, let's wait for... It is Chimetla. We have to be careful crossing. This place needs a speed bump. Yes, it they does. They need a tope here. We made it. Okay. So your family. So my family has a boat race every year. We make these little boats and race them down the river. <laughs> it doesn't matter if you win the race um, because you just get bragging rights. But if you lose, you have to put the race on for next year. Ah. So we've been doing this for over 40 years. And unfortunately, I lost for the first time. Oh boy. So we started coming up with themes to keep things fresh. So I have a theme of Kentucky Derby. So okay. I have been at all of the Segundos buying things to make hats with and little horses to oh. use as trophies for different things. A lot of stuff. It's And this is where I get it. Yeah, this is perfect. It's perfect for like Halloween or... Absolutely. Yeah. Actually, I'm not sure. I've been to this, this one, one. used to be in the... Hola! How are you? I told you we would come. <laughs> See? I was telling my friend Brighton... Hola. That it's nice when I come here because I always get a Spanish lesson. Sí. You always tell me how to say something right. <laughs> I, got a, I got a beautiful piece of furniture uh, that I'm using as a bar from him. Oh. Um, so yeah, this is huge. Yeah. Um, oh, oh, actually, coffee mugs. That is something oh. that was supposed to be on my list. I love really big coffee mugs. Um, so. That is on my list. We'll start searching for oh. those as well. Oh, and some of the things still have the tags from Goodwill. Uh, yes, so open they do. that puppy up. So that would have been $8 from Goodwill. We'll see what they are going to charge here. But uh, right. yeah, the Goodwills in Portland are very expensive. Oh. But still a good deal. Right. I like Spanish looking mugs. Me or too. Like, like Mexican looking. I tell you what, tell Eva, she's, she's good at that too. So if you're needing some shoes, it might take you a little bit of time to put together a set. I said I was looking for shoes, but I don't know if we have all day to go through. Look at these I don't guys. know if that color would stay. Those are all plastic, right? What do you think, right? guys? This might be like the win. Oh my God, is it a ten and a half? Oh. But it has to be glass. I'm tempted. I'm very tempted. For the mosaic? Jesus. Oh, finding for the, deals, meals, for the finding plate. match in here. Uh, to be. Look at that. Right there. And it's a Miko Lotti, which I don't know anything about that. <laughs> yeah, so we got some Toms, we got some Skechers, so good brands and in good shape. Right. Okay, there we go. That's the better deal. Tanya just told me the shoes are in order over here. Here's where I should be looking. Oh, look at these guys. This is kind of fun. Wait, this is this women's? I think we're on women's. Yeah. So one of the problems in Mexico is finding men's shoes that are large can be kind of hard because Mexican men have smaller feet. So one thing, if you're, uh, if you're a guy with big feet, make sure you bring down some big shoes, especially if you have like size, you know, 12 or something. Um, very hard to find those shoes, even in a regular shoe store.
So this reminds me of my dad. My dad loved these, I don't even know what they're called. Uh, Dickens Village, yes, he would love this. So my dad was a big shopper too. So we called him the super shopper. He would, if you, you pointed out something in his house, he could tell you exactly how much of a deal this. he got out it, how much of a deal off the deal off the deal. My problem uh, is, is, is so, it's- uh -oh. oh no, it's this Dickens Village is, is, has a little chip in it. Eve is on a lookout to find a specific game. Oh, what is it? Rummy Cube? Rummy Cube. Okay. We Add saw one list. once. It's like What's... Rummy, but with, with uh, tiles. I have noticed that a lot of the Segundos have areas that are really dark just because they're relying on natural sunlight and some areas just don't have it and there's not necessarily lights in here. <laughs> what is <laughs> Woohoo! Farmer John. Yeah. <laughs> so we're trying to find a few bags. Oh, okay, digging for out the, some for the ladies, and yeah, we'll just find out what he wants for them, and um, you know, hopefully find a couple. Um, just look for just are these purses? Are these? I'm not sure what it is. Somebody else has opened it already. There's more than one. <laughs> It's like a big pillowcase. I think it is a pillowcase, like a like a really big, oh, like a body, a body pillowcase. Oh. Let's talk about uh, getting prices on this. So you just you just called over. Oh, you yes. said Senor I called him over. <laughs> so these would be for charity. Just want to know what would be our best value. We don't have. We won't take all of them. Oh, okay. But but just maybe what you could do to help us out a little bit to to fill in some that things. That one is in the 200 pesos. 200 pesos. That one 150. 150. 140. 140. And the 100 pesos. 100. 200. Oh my goodness. 100. Okay. 100, 150. Hope you're keeping track of that. Yeah. That one. A 180 pesos. 180. Yeah. 150. 150. Give me 500 on the three. 500 yeah. three? Okay, let me kind of add all these up. Give me and uh, all this together, 1,000 for you. Let me, okay, let me think about it. Okay. Why, he, what, he'd like a price though from you. Yeah, see, I necessito un precio para un cama. See? What okay. precio? What precio? Buen precio. <laughs> Si. Sí. Si, sí, si, sí, si. Sí. Okay. Para este. Ooh. ¿Cuánto cuesta? Uh, esto tengo... Uh, en, en inglés porque mi, mi, los, 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 los viewers speak English. <laughs> okay. Okay. How much for the whole set? I don't know if we need that many. I don't know if I have enough stuff to stuff them. So, 45,000 pesos. So that is 200. Yeah. No, wait. Two, Sorry. 2,000. 140. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So about 2,000. So, okay. So what was the price of the other one? Um, oh boy. Now, we gotta, now we're trying to remember. Ladies. That's a lot of purses. So, it is a lot of purses, so I have to pick and choose. Eva, um, how big are the ones that you have? This one for sure. I think this one's in fairly good shape. This is a backpack, which might be nice. It holds more things. Mm -hmm. I don't know. 
where he went. Okay, we narrowed them down. Eva. Look at Eva. The, oh. the starfish with the serving pieces of shells. That's 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 Cute. fun. Okay, so I I can't do a thousand pesos since I have to be able to fill them all. So I've narrowed it down to a few. I'm sorry. See. Only these. Only these. Ah, only. Okay. Quantos? How about 500 pesos? 500 pesos for them all. Give me seven, Oops. 700 pesos all together. How about 600? Oh, come on. Come on, it's a donation. No, it's not. Ah, okay. 600? Sí. Gracias, senor. 300 pesos. So that's like $16 and I'm never gonna wear them, but they were good for the contest. It was a good thought. It was a well, good thought is right. maybe, we'll see. Cool. So you know what, these two guys are subscribed to this channel. Are you? Make sure you click the subscribe button, the bell, and the all message. Oh, look at that, isn't that for fishing? Oh yeah, for like fly yes. fishing or something. Yes, this is a different one. She's always had a lot of blow ups. Oh. Oh. Okay, so here's the smaller segundo. There is kind of a mix of big and small. Oh, for little kid toys. For my grandson who's coming in November. <laughs> I can put him to work. Yep. You gotta properly rake your gravel here. Yes. Very important. <laughs> oh boy. If I had a cat, this would be oh wait, you have to stitch him yourself. Whoa, no, no, no. Okay, so I did mention wanting these door stoppers. So oh. that was something, but they're not cool. So we'll we'll see. I'm, I'm very picky when it comes to Segundo shopping. So so Tanya, yeah, a lot of this stuff is new. Is new. So yeah, so a lot of this is new in and amongst with, um, I believe, some used items. Um, yeah, this is this is my first time in here. So okay, we're learning yeah. together. I noticed that there's a couple of places that are like uh, maybe getting overstock mm -hmm. and bringing it down. Like uh, these, isn't this a Target brand here? Um, my father would know. He was big at shopping at Target. But um, oh, look at these big things of chalk. So yeah, I think this is mostly new, new. stuff, and maybe they're they're getting it just you know a slightly different model of getting stuff. Shoes. Yeah. And there are some stores that are like specifically like Amazon. Yes. They get the stuff from Amazon. The one overstock. down there on the end before the, the By the Oxo. Are fantastic. Yep. Okay, these shoes, Eva pointed these out. We gotta check on the size. <laughs> oh, They're nice and, and sparkly. And me, me. See if she wants them, it's just depending. I see a lot of these showing up at Goodwills in the US. Yes. This, whatever this brand is. So we're we're just gonna keep going back and forth across the street to the best ones here. So, so she has a lot of really interesting things here, um, been but in this she's one? pretty much firm on price. Ah, uh, okay. Good to know. Yes. Hola. Hola, amigo. We're here. This is nice. Ooh, look at these. Those are fantastic. Those look like they would hold a door open. That they open. would. Definitely hold a door. Ooh, ah, we got how much fish, on those? too. This, these ones. Mil quinientos, fifteen hundred, so seventy. For both of those. Okay. How about the fish? Nine hundred each. Don't you think that would have had glass on it, and that's why it's got? Oh, the... it's probably two. Yes. Yep, yeah, there's two of them. Yeah. Okay. So these are fantastic. I love them both, actually. And the shell. I'm thinking yeah, about what a great this. idea. Thinking about this. <laughs> so I did notice, Tanya, that you did bring your own bag, but we're also using the purses as a bag. So that's another good tip: is to uh, yes. come prepared because, especially here in Chamitla, they're really. Um, this, this is probably like a half mile long stretch. Right. Um, so, and you don't want to go back to your car every time you purchase something. Right. Okay. How have you been? I'm focusing oh, in on good, something here. Good, good. He's finding something already. 
Uh, oh, that's fantastic. Oh, oh but it's too not, bad it wasn't iron. It's not heavy. That one's good. It's not heavy. I think Nugget would like what that. What is that? Hey, my friend, question. What are these green bags with the fish in there? What What are those? You need a prize or what is it? Well, what is it? Only the fish. Oh, it's just the, the fish. Oh. Container in the world. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's three pieces. Three? Three, three pieces? Yeah, they can one in each bag. Oh, okay. huh. interesting. Well, they could be painted up while you're here. You're good <laughs> yeah, at that. Yeah. <laughs> interesting. Yeah, interesting. It's part of, like, Esto or Esto. Depends. Like that one? Mm -hmm. 40 no more pesos. Oh, okay. 30 pesos. Okay. Depend, you know. Yeah. That one, 20, 20. They want 40. 40. Okay. Okay. Gracias. So, so between $1 and $2 a piece approximately for, uh, that's pretty typical for, I think of them as dog toys. So Cat really likes dinosaurs. And I really like turtles. I typically go back. So it's, I feel like I'm going to get a number of toys and we'll maybe give them to her over time. Sometimes she tears them up. Oh, nice little dinosaurs. Meh. So one of the things I like to do is kind of have an idea of pricing. And maybe right. Tanya can, can talk about that a little bit. But like with those two bedroom sets, I'm not really in... We, you know, don't need a bedroom set right now, but it's good to see the prices for different places and kind of who is charging more than who is charging less. Um, well, I would just say as a comparison on the bedroom sets, I felt like the first place we were at, it was finished. There were some missing knobs that were going to be replaced. Uh, the other set we just saw is definitely in need of work yeah. and they were comparable priced. So, yeah. Yes. I do need something to store water or whatnot in. When I go play pickleball, but how about that big baby bottle? So he just brought this out uh, for 900 pesos, $45. Um, we were just commenting how it, it looks pretty, but it'd be cool if we needed a box like that, but we don't really need one. And these were a little too expensive for just being doorstops. Yeah. Uh, sheen to it. I mean, in theory, you could if if you were into you know the big plumage yeah those types of things Just having stuff in them. stick out of mm -hmm. them mm -hmm. okay hmm. best to this take is... a picture and send to your wife yeah i know she's just gonna say no so we already know that oh okay got it okay <laughs> 100 pesos para tres okay no necesito en bolsa okay nugget you better be happy <laughs> See, I know Cat will like these. I, I have always get a permission to buy dinosaur stuff. <laughs> um, this one's okay, but is, is Gabrielle Gabrielle here? Key? Uh, see, I like this one too. Yes. Yes. This one usually has a lot of glassware. It seems more open in the middle right now. Yes, I agree. We've gotten some rugs from upstairs. All the rugs in our house came from. It's a little up scary. Up yeah, it's very scary. Yeah. Up there. Like yeah. you feel like you're gonna fall right through. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna make a trip up here to show you guys. Yeah, you can definitely feel the holes underneath the carpets. No more beds up here. Yeah, let's just, uh, so I'm just going to bounce. You can see the floor is questionable. Gabriel! Hola, amigo! How are you? Good, 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 good. You got anything new and good? <laughs> we met Gabrielle when we first got here and we bought our furniture, our bedroom Hello. furniture. Hello. So he, um, bless his heart, came with us to help us deliver it and unload it. And, oh, and we see him all the time. Good. Yeah. <laughs> We're making you famous. <laughs> He's a good guy. And this, that's, 
actually a cute little stand. Yeah, this this almost looks like a mausoleum or something. Like you'd open Ooh. that up and find bodies. Okay, it looks like there's there's more stuff through this little hole in the wall. Watch your head. Oh yeah, wow, more bed, headboards, footboards. Oh no no no. <laughs> smell of Mexico. Every now and then. Oh, that smell. Yes. Yes. That I smelt over there. Yeah. Part of the reason I don't go in real deep on a lot of them on this side, because mm -hmm. it seems to be only on this side, uh, is a little bit of sewer gas. Right. Okay, Kat would approve of this. She loves glass blocks, so this could be a good doorstop. So we've got some potential there. I could give permission for that. So I don't think I've ever really seen the traditional Mexican pottery cups here. I think most of this stuff is coming from the United States. Um, but you never know what you'll find at a Segundo. Oh, so half the fun for me is just looking through things, digging to find what you didn't even know you needed. Like, I totally forgot I need plates to break up for a mosaic table I'm doing. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this appears to be an Anna Lee, which are um, a collectible, and sometimes they have knockoffs, and I'm trying to find a tag or something that would tell me if it's a true Anna Lee or not, but that's what that looks like to me. Hmm. Yeah, interesting. Yeah, the um, I don't know if we got that on video where um, where the uh, first guy was his what was his name King 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 yes. talked about finding a gold ring in something. Yes, yes, it, it really does look like the painting of Anna Lee, but I'm no expert. <laughs> sure, let's uh, let's see how we're gonna do with prices here on what we've dug up. Two. <laughs> And that one. Okay. And discount because they're dirty, right? <laughs> 300 pesos? I don't think so. <laughs> okay. Gracias. 50. One five? Five zero. Five zero. Yes. Uh -oh. five, five, zero, zero. Yeah, yeah. Five zero zero. <laughs> <laughs> Gracias. Okay, can I hand over my pieces and oh. get a price on these to see which one I want? Oh, no, we got it right here. Oh, uh, what? Yes. No, we, yes, there's plenty of room. Okay. Okay. Slide the two. Precios. Este. Oh, este. Si. Sí. Sorry. No, that's okay. You Just put them right here. You didn't hit me. I don't care if they break. Para, para, para una. I break them anyways at some point. So, mm -hmm. Kathleen, that's true. that we'll have to work on. 100. 50. Okay. Oh, Ooh, God, the one my wife heavy. likes is more expensive. Just a second one. Than the other. So $5. For cookies. Ah, see. Okay. I think I, I might. Well, you guys will see. I found that a lot of these on the right hand side here are primarily clothes. Yep. A lot of them brand new clothes from um, Costco. Saw the Costco labels on them. Um, but then there's a couple good ones down here. And the first Saguna we went to, King, his wife has a store right down here at the end, which we'll have to visit. Um, a new one opened up here. Um, still a little messy in there, yeah. but they're getting there. <laughs> Been in that one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I like this one. It's one of these down here. I can never remember which one is which. I'm bad at that. Um, King's wife is this one okay. on the very end one. Oh, so that's that's going to be that's King's be new place. Uh, New place, yes. it right next to his wife's place. There you go, Eva. Uh, we should have checked the price because King had this too. We could have checked his uh, his, his wife's wife price versus his, his wife's. <laughs> oh my goodness! You will never get lost in that. Someone will always be able to find you. So yeah, so there's a lot of stores that are solely clothing or 90 percent clothing mm -hmm. we've got some shoes too um i'm usually not as interested in the clothing just because it takes so long to dig through the piles of clothing to find something um and really i don't go through clothes that much so another tip so one of the things i found is that you may make an offer on an item 
and it's not accepted, so you walk away. You come back three months later, that item is still there, or in my case, it's been over a year for a chair that she knows that I want, I'm just not willing to pay the price she wants. So it's been sitting there for over a year. So I've learned that um, it's okay for them to say no as well. Okay, let's talk about um, how much, how often you'll find prices on things. Um, I would say it's not as often as I would like. This is one of the few that I found that does have the prices listed. Um, there's one across the street we'll go to that almost everything is priced. Yes, yeah, I like that, yes. but um, I think it's, I don't know if it's somewhat of a Mexican thing that they can do a little more bargaining or something with you. Could be. Uh, so if you look online, like on Facebook or something, when someone's listing an apartment, if they're Mexican, they don't list the price and they won't put the price on a public comment. They hair. will only put it in a, um, a di uh, direct message. Right. Oh, so we've got some puzzles that are still in the original box. I don't know who buys a puzzle secondhand that's been opened because you just know there's at least one piece missing. But there's lots of puzzles. <laughs> carrot coat. <laughs> oh yes, that little carrots. Looks like carrot. They should have green, green little green, things. Green, that's right. In there though. Brand new. Go figure. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> that one didn't sell. No. <laughs> Buenos dias. Wow, wouldn't these be pretty? But I'd hate to break up the set. Mm. For the mosaic. For project. your breaking yeah, project. For my yeah. breaking project. Look yes. at these guys. Oh, the oh, lighter. Cool. They look like, um, what is that game where you play with the... Um, bocce ball. Bocce ball. Yes. I think they would break. This might be good for a oh my God. drink set. Is, uh, that, is that a Yeti? I no, think it's, it's a, a, it's a, fake it's a Yeti. fakey. It's lighter, but mm. still it would be good. Yep. got to get a price on that because I do need that for... And they've got a bunch of them. Wow. I wonder I need what that for pickleball. Yes. So we found Dosietos Ochenta for these $14. I can probably find a used one. These are, these look like they're probably new. Need to uh, extend oh, your hair. Yeah, last time, last video you had long hair. Yes, You could I have did. long hair again. Cut it off. Yes. Yeah. Oh, look at it. It's a re like a Rapunzel a braid. braid. Rapunzel. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you got to pick it up now for Halloween. We know this. Yeah. That's true. It will be gone. Yes. Have you been paying attention to the music in this episode? It's Shooter Ford, a La Paz musician who I met when he was playing at a restaurant just a few blocks from my house. I've linked to his Facebook page down below so that you can check out more of his work. But let's get back to browsing. So he has a lot of things that are brought in from Guadalajara here. A lot of the things that we saw when we went and did the tequila train. Uh, yes. Yeah. This is the thing with being out here on the peninsula. So La Paz is on the Baja Peninsula. And so there's less, maybe a, it's less easy to get stuff. Like Guadalajara, right. a lot of stuff the comes from there. The paintings, so yeah, paintings. Um, uh, statues, faces that are back here. There we go. That could be a doorstop. I yeah. feel like that'd be a little sacrilegious though. I guess if I'm going to be sacrilegious, I should choose something a little more Catholic. Oh, uh, so this is the stuff that they sell in Guadalajara. Right. This is kind of new. So I wonder if they have the cups here. He used to. Oh, those are cool. These are, these are, are fairly, cool. yeah. Kind of reminds me, we've got something like that in our uh, living room already. Yeah. And it's actually it's fairly nice. heavy. Yeah. Yeah, I guess this is the stuff we could have put in those. Um, in, yes, exactly. Other, oh yeah. my gosh. And then you can buy them by the color. Oh, you can, yeah. Yes. Oh, more turtles. You know, I like turtles. That's pretty cool. That'd make a good doorstop. Oh, yeah. That, that's a. Isn't that amazing? That is that is very that, heavy? Yeah. Is it um, like a, a resin or a. Terra, I think it's a terracotta. A terracotta? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, here we go. We've got some um, old Christmas stuff, but it is Mexican because <laughs> it says Feliz Navidad. Love it. Okay, so we're starting to see some of that pottery. So this, some of the pottery stores, this would be maybe 110 pesos, maybe 120, something like that. So we'll see what um, 50 pesos for a bowl. Uh, 40 pesos for that, so 40 pesos. That's a pretty good deal for uh, for these for these mugs here. Let's go find out about that uh, iguana thing. Okay, so we're gonna get a price 
I always ask for a buen precio, a good price. Salen 400. 400. So 400, which is 200 or $20. This one's pretty good. I might be buying something today. Oh, this is good. Um, yes, that is um, perfecto. Gracias. Um, so 400, pero hay un. ¿Cómo se dice este? Es es una crack. Uh, uh, Fractura, 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 pero fractura. entonces, uh, so twenty dollars, entonces, uh, 300, 300 pesos. Está bien, muchas gracias, perfecto. Okay. Um, we recently bought from it, like I said, it was a really good price. Oh, Eva, he's open. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we definitely have to go in there. I was closed, told he was going to be closed for 50 days. So, not always clear when things will be open or closed. So, uh, yeah, but this is what closed looks like, I guess. Just wrap something around, but um, I guess we can take a look in. And, and back here behind this gate is Merkin. Uh, I've got another video about that. Um, really good. Um, what is what is Merkin? What kind of Chilean? Yeah, more Chilean, I believe. Oh, that's a sweet rocking chair. Uh, that is a sweet rock. Looks like it, it doesn't rock. See, this is where oh, I would be nice. had I bought those uh, those things for what was it, thirty five dollars? I'd be in the doghouse. I think it does. No, no, no. Put it back in there. Just his nose doesn't have to be behind that piece of seed grass. Yeah, but the, the color oh. on the back looks like it matches perfectly. It does. Yeah. That's kind of fun. <laughs> yeah. We got a little maze going on here. Yes. <laughs> um, and I think you got to go back the other way. Yep, there are dead ends. Yes. <laughs> I like those little plastic uh, acrylic chairs. Yes. <laughs> Some things are unique. I like this couch. This would like totally go in our house it's... up in Portland, but ah. not quite so much at our house here, especially because we have a palapa roof and cats like the next hurricane's going to blow away our house. So <laughs> no nice stuff. Look at those these. are nice, like folding chairs that look nice. Oh, and they're oh, like bar stool height. That. Wow, they are yeah. stools. Yeah. Oh, those are just the two? Just the two. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, 1500 a pair. 1500 a pair, $75 for two yeah. chairs. Wow. Yeah, mirrors are definitely cool, especially when they're unique like this and not yeah. just square. How much on your mirror? Where'd he go? This. I sold the You did? Oh. What'd you sell it for? These, these have nice. nice roller drawers on them. Aren't these nice? So I love sunshine, but I'm just not sure my husband would be happy with me if I brought this home and made him paint it. <laughs> because he painted a new uh, one for me, what, two days ago, I think. But it's, it's fantastic. cool, though. It's very fun. Yeah. Yeah. So sunshine's a good theme for Mexico. Absolutely. Absolutely. Sometimes it takes a while to get a price, um, especially when there's a language barrier for me. Um, sometimes it can be, you know, five, ten minutes waiting on somebody else who's had a lot of questions. Um, so I'm hoping for some quick turnaround time today. Yeah, there's definitely something in Mexico. Things don't necessarily ever move fast, but uh, especially when, when someone's having a little conversation, they're not going to stop uh, their conversation to give us a price. You right kind of some of those wait around and place. look at some other stuff while you wait. Serial. Oh. 150 por los dos. 150 para dos. Mm -hmm. so, uh, both. so 150, so 750 for both. For those of you who live in La Paz, you can take the Centenario bus right out to the Segundos. I've got a video about that too. This is our haul so far. So one of the things I have to do is um, use my calculator or, or my phone conversion app to let me know exactly what the cost is going to be. 
Um, they're so generous. I just have them punch the Mexican pesos into my phone and then I make my decision, yay or nay. Um, and they have been um, extremely accommodating to that. But it's also, what's interesting is I'm understanding the numbers more and more. Yes. Yeah, very helpful. Yeah, I'm always like second guessing whether I got the numbers right. Numbers are just hard in Spanish for some reason. So, yeah. Um, but they're always, they'll pull out a calculator, they'll pull out their phone and show you the number. Okay, so I am thinking of a YouTuber that would want this water bottle. Let me know down in the comments which YouTuber that is. Yeah, this is nice because they have prices on everything. She's going to show us the number. Let's, can, let's, can you film? Wait, no, no, no. No, let's, uh, oh, uh, let's, let's say, quisiera ver, uh, mirar su uh, teléfono con los numeros. so good. 180. Si. Okay. Okay. Um, 100. Okay. Wow. Tal vez este, solo este, para... Sí, está bien, perfecto. <laughs> Gracias. How much? How much was the plate? But he can pan it. It was in here. Yeah, they were both in there. There it is. Okay, so today very successful. I ended up with I think about seven bags for uh, for the women, and we'll step that with all kinds of wonderful things. Um, my and that was of, one of your intentions, was to get the bags. That was definitely my primary intention. But then my favorite thing I think I got was this to go in my casita. And as I was playing around with the sand, I think there might be a pair of earrings in here. So oh, who yeah. knows? Something just popped up. Yeah. So who knows? That, oh. Oh. oh, what is it? Is it a shell or is it an ear? I don't know. We'll have to extra go home fun. and... Extra fun. And then I got these amazing... Uh, four chargers um, to use for decoration. And I thought these were a great buy. Cool. And then you also got uh, plates for- uh, For my mosaic for project, mosaic which project. That I had no intention of doing that until we saw, we saw some things that would really work well, bright colors and so on and so forth. Okay, cool. So now let's ask Eva how she did. So, so Eva, your intention was to get something for Tanya. Something, yes. And this is what I found. It's, wow. um, we don't know if it's going to be broken apart for the mosaic or if she's going to use it for a decoration because it is gorgeous. Very Absolutely nice. beautiful. And that is going so. to be your, your contest entry too. Yeah. My, my, so, my so remember that for the contest, uh, entry there, Eva's contest entry, very cool plate. <laughs> So I did really well too. I got the water bottle, which I don't think I had that intention up front, but I did have this intention. I had a couple things to stop the doors with. I got some dog toys, which should always be an intention for going shopping at the Segundos and just some like wall art stuff. I am pretty excited. Now my entry into the contest is going to be this big, whoops. Okay. I'm going to just try to hold this here. This pot with an iguana on it. So here are your three contest items. We're going to do this in a separate post in the community tab. So head over to the community tab. You can vote there. Uh, also leave comments down below. So there we go. It's been uh, about three hours of shopping here today. We achieved a few of the things we wanted to achieve, which is great. And we got some extra stuff, which is maybe even better. So you know I can't have a video that doesn't have at least a little bit of cat giving me a disapproving look. So let's see what she thinks of what I've purchased today. You like this? So far... I love that. The disapproving look is that you say I always give you a disapproving look. <laughs> oh my God, that is adorable. 
That is adorable. <laughs> oh, nuggies. Nuggies, nuggies. Nuggies, nuggies. Come here. <gasps> what is this? Is this a dinosaur pterodactyl? Roar. Okay, nuggies approved. Oops, uh, not nuggies. Nuggies approved. Nuggies <gasps> nuggies approved. There we go. There we go. That is adorable. This yours. Okay, we're gonna have to do these in a different order. Oh, little is that a dinosaur? Mm -hmm. Oh, I love it too. Oh, even better! You're you're a spirit animal. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh no, good it's a candle. Good, good find. I love that stick thingy. That's a good. I paid find. less than that. And for pickleball? Yay, you need this so you stop drinking mine, my water when we go. For holding doors closed? Oh, that's a good heavy piece. Good finds. And something else for holding doors closed. Ooh, I like that. We're not going to put huh? that on a door. I totally thought that would be the disapproving look. No, no, we're going to put a candle in that. Oh. That's pretty. <laughs> good job. Okay, tell people to watch another video that's over your right shoulder. Is this my right? <laughs> yep. Watch another video over my right shoulder. <laughs> Hasta luego. Hasta luego. Put the... Maggie likes turtle better. <laughs> That's a happy. And a happy nugget. Get that turtle. Get that. Arr, arr.